The young woman whose family was massacred by her uncle takes the stand at his murder trial. Cassidy Stay relived the day her uncle, Ronald Haskell, forced his way into the family home in Houston. Please don't hurt us, she told him. I was trying to appeal to his humanity. But Haskell executed her parents and four siblings. Boom, boom, she said, as she described how the victims were shot one by one. Cassidy was also shot, but miraculously survived by playing dead. She showed the jury the scar where her uncle's bullet grazed her skull, saying it felt like a burning hot knife. Cassidy not only seemed brave, she seemed almost defiant on the stand. Reporter Tom Abrams is covering the trial for KTRK-TV in Houston. In one dramatic moment, Cassidy pointed out the killer in the court. Then she glared at him for an extended period of time while prosecutors asked her the next question. Haskell never looked at her once. She showed how her mom wrestled with the gunman as she tried to protect her family. But she broke down listening to audio of herself recorded by a first responder on that horrible day five years ago when she was 15. Cassidy Stay testified for more than 90 minutes, and it was all for the prosecution. The defense did not ask her a single question. They apologized for her loss, and then she was off the stand. The judge allowed cameras to photograph Cassidy, but not to record any audio of her testimony. Meantime, Haskell has pled not guilty by reasons of insanity. During his niece's testimony, he kept his eyes on the floor. His lawyer says he was sedated.